It was just a normal day when Jeff was driving his Model X home after work in Auckland, New Zealand. Jeff thought nothing of it as he passed a guy driving a Mitsubishi Galant. Apparently, the Mitsubishi driver got really offended by Jeff's overtake. This started some of the craziest road rage we've ever seen on this channel. The video you're about to watch ended up being used as evidence in court to prove charges of attempted assault, reckless driving, behaving threateningly, and causing over 45,000 US dollars of damage to Jeff's Tesla. Okay, let's dive straight into the action. Get ready because this video keeps ramping up and gets crazier and crazier. About three miles down the road after the overtake, the Mitsubishi driver wound up for his attack. He stopped in the middle of the road and when Jeff noticed the guy opening his door, he floored it to get out of there. At this point, Jeff knew that something was off when the other driver, who'd been tailgating him, pulled this stunt. Jeff knew he had to get away from him. Unfortunately, traffic was building up, so there really wasn't anywhere for him to go, and the Mitsubishi driver quickly caught up with him. We can see the driver gesturing in his car. Next, he starts tailgating Jeff extremely closely. After pulling in front of Jeff again, the guy brake checks him before coming to a complete stop, once more blocking both lanes. Jeff took evasive action and quickly drove around him. This sent the other driver into full Mad Max mode and he finally decided that he wanted to ram Jeff. First, he sideswiped the Tesla, nearly losing control in the process. Once he regained control, he continued to block Jeff. Jeff tried to get away again, but he closed the gap and both vehicles were immobilized. The Mitsubishi driver got out and started pounding on the Tesla, screaming and threatening Jeff. Jeff realized there was no way he was going to be able to argue with the infuriated man and remained in his vehicle while calling 911 and waiting for the police to arrive. After a while, the guy finally stopped hitting the Tesla. That's when another car right behind them tried to leave. The guy stepped in front of her car, blocking her from leaving. He was actually blocking the lady from leaving because he thought she would be a witness who would testify that Jeff had hit him. Fortunately, the police arrived within minutes and walked over to the witness, who told them that they needed to put handcuffs on the man in front of her car. Once the guy was in cuffs, Jeff got out and talked with the police. He gave the police the full Tesla cam video of the incident from his flash drive, and they were able to review the video right away. The police were very thankful for the Tesla cam footage and told Jeff they couldn't have asked for better evidence. Thanks to the video, it ended up being an open and shut court case. The repair bill for Jeff's Tesla was 45,000 US dollars, which his insurance covered, but it took over three months for Jeff to get his car back from the Tesla service center. Based on what happened, Jeff thinks the guy must have been under the influence of one or more mind-altering substances. Stay safe, everyone.